la convención sobre Ay, la discriminación de todas las formas de discriminación sobre la mujer. Hi, my Lord. Hi, Carlos. Hi, good evening. Hello. Hello, good evening. No son los adultos mayores. No me funcionan mis audífonos. How are you? Hello, minor. How are you? Hello, teacher. Very good. Okay. Are you fine? How was your day today? Did you do, did you do something positive today? Yes. Hello, Oli. We can hear you. Good evening. Sí, le escucho. El micrófono sí, tal vez los audífonos no. Eh, puede utilizar la opción que está dentro de la, de la reunión Zoom, eh, donde dice revisar audífonos y bocinas. No oigo nada. Hello, uh, Luis. Good evening. Hello. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Hello, Pablo. Good evening. Hello, good evening. Carlos. Hello. Yes, Oli, we can hear you. Carlos, lo voy a incorporar dentro de unos 10 minutos. Está bien. No hay problema. Eh, puede arreglar ese, ese problema, ¿no? Tómese el tiempo. No hay sí. problema. Ok. Okay, very good. Let's get ready to start. Okay. Yesterday, do you remember? Yes, Luis, send me a message. Do you need something? Luis, le mandaste un mensaje? Pablo, are you ready? Yes. Already. Okay, good. Okay, very good. Yesterday we learned um, could you and would you mind? Do you remember? To give instructions, to give a request. Okay. So, what did your boss tell you to do today? What did your boss tell you to do? Did he give you some instruction today? Did he tell you? Could you please send me an email? Would you mind sending me an email? What did your boss tell you today? Minor? Hello? Hello? Estás ahí? Estás poniendo atención? Estaba un poco distraído, teacher. Okay, all right. Yesterday, what did we learn sorry, yesterday? Sorry. Could you? Would you mind? Eso es lo que aprendimos ayer. Could you? Would you mind? Okay. Did, did your boss give you instructions today? Did your supervisor give you instructions? Did he give you a request? Yes? ¿Qué te dijo tu boss? What did your boss tell you today? Um, uh, call you my uh, answering emails. Would you mind answering the emails? Very good. Answer the emails. Okay, excellent. Uh, Pablo, what did your boss tell you to do? Could you take those as first parts? Could you take what else? Those? Tones, spurs, parts. Eh, tones, no sé qué es tones. Eh, ya, eh, esos, tones. En español, tones. ¿qué esos. es? En... Those. Llevar... Ok, those. those. Mm -hmm. Can you take those? those? those. Spare. Spare. Parts. 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 Very, very good. Could, could you take those spare parts? Very good. 
David, what did your boss tell you today? Estamos repasando, could you, would you mind? Okay. What did your boss uh, tell you today? Told you develop web application for customer. Very good, excellent. Luis, well, bueno. ah, okay. Ya, ya te voy a dar eh, para que hagas con would mind. Would okay. you mind? Luis, what did your boss tell you to do today? Could you generate a report? Could you generate a report? Very good, very good. Okay, Carla, eh, creo que estabas aquí ayer, ¿verdad? Crisia, creo que no. Um, Carla, what did your boss tell you today? Did he tell you to do something? Uh, call your help with today's uh, paper work. Okay, could, could you help me, right? Could you help me with today's paperwork? Very good, very good. David, do you remember how to use would you mind? Would you mind? Okay, would you mind updating the mm -hmm. report in server? Very good. Would you mind updating the report in the server? Excellent. We use ING, right? Yes. We use ING. Okay. Excellent. So we're talking about communication in the workplace. So, esa es la primera lección de esta semana, la, de la que aprendimos ayer. Could you? Would you mind? We use it to make requests or to give instructions, to give requests. Okay? Tal vez algunos de ustedes son supervisores o tienen otras personas a su cargo. What do you tell them? Instructions. ¿Le dan alguna instrucción? No, you don't have nobody, no son managers, supervisors, todavía no. All right. But if you did have, for example, you have someone, right? Then you can tell them, could you help me with the paperwork? Can you, could you clean the office? Uh, could you send the customer an email? Okay. So, Ya cuando ustedes sean supervisores, van a dar esas instrucciones, right? ¿Cómo? Lo mismo. Could you? Would you mind? Okay, excellent. Let's go to the next section. Let me share my, my book. Let me share my book with you. Okay, let me make it bigger. So you guys can see. All right, very good. So. The name of this unit, unit number three, is communication in the workplace. We're talking about communication. So, ya aprendimos la primera herramienta, right? Could you? Would you? Uh, today we're going to learn should and should not. ¿Han escuchado esa palabra? Should, should not. For example, if I give you an instruction, you shouldn't chat in your phone during a meeting you shouldn't chat in your phone during a meeting we use these to talk about regulations or rules in the in the workplace for example ahora creo que en su trabajo si es presencial qué tienen que hacer con la mascarilla you should you should wear mask, okay? You have to have a mask, right? Let me see, aquí tengo una, okay? If your boss, he sees you, you don't have a mask, no va a regañar, ¿va? What is he gonna tell you? Or the security officer or whoever, right? If you don't have a mask, no va a regañar. ¿Qué le va a decir? You should wear a mask, okay? So should is to give instructions, okay? Hay reglas en su trabajo ahorita con esta situación de la pandemia. Hay algunas reglas en sus trabajos, sí? Yes, the uniform. Okay, so usemos should, right? You should, y después de should vamos a usar un verbo. You should wear uniforms, okay? Very good. Hay otras? Can you think of another one? 
you should, you should what? Algún deber, algo que tienen que cumplir, you should? Uh, meet. You should mute? Uh, meet. Mute, como quitarle el volumen? Mute? No, teacher, how do you say, um, somebody, uh, met us, teacher? Go. Or in English, go. Uh -huh. You should? You should go. Okay, very good. Aquí te, fal aquí, well. aquí te va a faltar un verbo. ¿Cuál verbo podemos usar? You should, hmm? you should um, alcanzar. How do you say alcanzar uh, in English? Um, uh, I'm, going to, I'm going to give you uh, the, the word. Which? Reach. Reach. You should reach. Puedes decir las metas. The goals. The goal. Okay. O si son las metas tuyas. Your goals. Okay. The goals. You should reach the goals. Very good, Luis. Okay. ¿Qué más? ¿Algunas otras reglas? ¿Instrucciones? Teacher, uh, uh, how do you say uh, tiempo? Time? Uh, horario. Schedule. Schedule. Uh -huh. So, ¿qué te dicen con el schedule? You should or you shouldn't? Eh, estar, bueno, estar siete, siete de la mañana, ocho de la mañana trabajando. At work. You uh, should be at work. Hora seven, de entrada. Uh -huh. Seven a.m. Okay. Yeah. Okay. You should be at work 7 a.m. Okay. Teacher, you should mm -hmm. wash the hands. Yes. Yes. Very good. Right. This that's a special rule for now with the pandemic. Right. Me imagino que tienen muchas regulaciones ahora. Right. You should. Yes. So very good. You at, should wash. I'm going to wash. Wash. The hands. Okay. Your hands. Very good. Your hands. Mm -hmm. You should wash your hands. Remember that after the verb, the modal verb should, I have to use another verb, que es a normal verb. For example, aquí, aquí usamos reach. You have to be. You should wash. So we're going to use a verb. Okay. Very good. Now, what happens if I want to use negative? Can I use negative? You should. You should not. You should not what? Algo que no tienen que hacer. Alguna regla? Uh, a rule that you have at work? Hmm? You should not. Racism, for example. You should not what? Racism. 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 Yes. You should not use racism. Okay. Very good. Okay. También puede decir you should not. You should not discriminate other employees yeah yes también pero estas son reglas right you should not yo sé que, que hay reglas donde trabajan right you have rules instruction okay quién es más quién es más se incorporaron ahorita let's see tenemos pablo uh, let's see, Harold, Francisco, Danilo, Alba. What is some rules? Algunas reglas in your workplace. Eh, no shoes. Eh, no shoes. Como no, no usar zapatos. Jewels. 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 
Joyas, jewels. Joyas. Yeah. Sí. Jewels. Se escribe así. No jewels in the, in the plant. Ok. Uh, so vamos a usar you should not. You should not what? Necesitamos un verbo. You should not. Use. Use. Jewels. You. Very good. Very good. You should not use jewels. Okay? Very good. Excellent. ¿Alguien más tiene otra? Este, you should not eat in the work area. You should not eat in the work area. Very good. Very good, Carla. You should not eat in the work area. Okay. Excellent. You should so, not eat during working hours, teacher. You should not eat during working hours. Very good. Very good, minor. Okay. All right. So today we're going to use this. And our project, eh, que lo vamos a hacer más adelante, our project is going to be creating a manual, like a rule book, right? Cuando ustedes empezaron con la empresa, les dieron algún tipo de reglamento, ¿verdad? Like a rules, right? So that, that is what we're going to do today, but we're going to do it in English. Okay, very good. Let's go to, let me see, somebody wrote me a message. You shouldn't eat in the office. Very good. You shouldn't receive family during time work. Good, Danilo. Very good. All right. Let's go to the conversation that we have. Okay. Conversation number two. Let me read it and you follow. I'm going to read it. Claudia, she says, I can't believe it. Robert is addicted to his phone. Did you see him? You're right. He should not chat in the meeting. Absolutely. That is not polite. He should answer his messages after the meeting. And we should not talk about him. That's not polite either. Agree. We should help him instead. All right. Excellent. Do you see the use here? He should not chat. Rule. Una regla. ¿Qué otra? He should answer his messages. Right? We should not talk about him. Okay? So, very good. ¿Qué otra? We should help him. Okay? So, some are positive, some are negative. Okay? Hay reglas positivas y hay reglas negativas. All right, so very, very good. This is what you're going to do. So exercise number two, what I want you to do is practice this conversation. Practice the language. Look at the grammar, okay? Very good. So let's practice the conversation, exercise two. Then, ¿qué vamos a hacer después? Exercise number three. Exercise number three, you have to think and, and make a, a little note there. Eh, don't, no se pongan a escribir todavía. Ya, ya vamos a tener la parte donde vamos a escribir. But only speaking. Speaking to your group. What are some polite behaviors? ¿Qué quiere decir behaviors? What are some polite behaviors? What is behavior? ¿Qué quiere decir polite? Política. No, no política, sino que, for example, when you say thank you, you're welcome. Thank you very much. Modales. Yes, correct. Pero más que modales son como, eh, como ética o, o como forma respetuosa. Como principios. Como, como principios. principios, yes, como polite, right? Polite behaviors. Quiere decir behaviors. Actions. Eh, cor comportamientos cortes o... Yes, that's correct. Right? Actions. What are some polite mm. behaviors you expect from your co-workers? Okay? So, esto es lo que ustedes esperan de otra persona. What are some polite behaviors? What are some, be what are some rude behaviors uh, you should not do in the workplace? So, aquí vamos a usar should. You should. Y aquí vamos a usar 
should not. You should not. Ok. So, traten de, así como estábamos haciendo al inicio de la clase, haciendo ejemplos. Ok, for example, uh, in, my, in my workplace, right, you should not, you should not uh, be late. You should not be late. Ok. No puedo estar tarde a la reunión yo. Ok. You should not be late to the Zoom meeting. Ok. You should be respectful to all the students. Ok. That's something that I have to do. Ok. So, think about your work. Ok. So, well, let's do exercise number two, which is the conversation practice, and then let's do exercise number three. Ok. Hacer una lista de should, shouldn't. No tienen que escribir, only speaking for right now, okay? All right, let's go to groups. Okay, accept the invitation, please. Go to groups. Harold, accept the invitation. There you go. Okay, le voy a compartir este pantalla sobre en el libro para poder explicarle. Tengo el libro. Ah, ok, pero bueno, si se va a la página 31. Sí, donde está. Um, what are some? Yes. Dos cuadritos. Yes. Ok. Eh, no, eh, primero está la conversación. Exercise number two, page 31. Okay. Page 31. Okay. Yes. Okay. okay. So let, let's practice the conversation. Okay. Exercise number two and exercise number three. You're going to use uh, should and should not. What are some rules in your job that you should do? What are some things you should do in your job? What are some things you shouldn't do in your job? Okay. Okay. Okay, teacher. Okay, eh, David, si vos empezó yo. Okay. Eh. Ah, okay. okay, hello. Question. Hello. Teacher. Sí, teacher, fíjese que, bueno, eh, Luis está de turno y yo acabo uh -huh. de ingresar, entonces no sabemos bien qué es lo que tenemos que hacer. Extras, bueno, es simplemente el libro. No me estoy saliendo fuera del libro para nada. So, page 31. Go to page 31 in your book. O si alguien quiere sí. compartir pantalla. Ajá. Ah, lo que, lo que pasa es que yo no tengo el libro, teacher, lo tengo en mi casa. La verdad no contaba con que me tenía que quedar ahora hasta tarde. Ah, but you should have it in your phone or something. Ok, bueno. Me, tal vez Carla puede compartir la pantalla. Maybe. Ve, yo lo tengo impreso, pero lo voy a buscar aquí en mi documento. Ok. Acá tengo el libro yo, Carla. Creo que usted es. Ok, lo, lo puse en el grupo de WhatsApp. If you want to see. Sí, acá lo, acá lo estoy viendo. Ahorita voy. Lo encontró, Carla. Sí. Ah, ok. Teacher. Uh -huh. Y lo que vamos a practicar es la conversación. You're going to practice conversation number two. Ok. Pero okay. Ya, perdieron, ya perdieron como 10 minutos. So let's go directly to the other section. Ok. The other section is exercise number three. Ok. Uh -huh. Estaban allí. Luis estaba cuando me estaba dando ejemplo de shooting, shooting. Luis. Sí. 
Okay? Sí, yes, teacher. So, number one, el primer cuadrito is should. Should. Uh, what, are, uh -huh. what are some polite behaviors you expect in your work? Number two, what are some rude behaviors you are not expected to do in your work? So, should and shouldn't. El primero should, el, primero, el segundo shouldn't. Okay? Shouldn't. So, okay. share, for example, you should not be late to work. You should wash your hands at work. You should wear a mask. Come on, empiecen. Tell me. All right, go. You should, um... ¿Cómo hago para compartir la pantalla? Tiene que ir a Zoom. Sí, estoy en Zoom ahorita. Ok, en el, abajo donde dice más, no sé si hay unas opciones que dice share. Uh -huh. Bueno, Luis está compartiendo ahora. Ajá, creo, sí, ahí está. Um, ¿Qué número de página era, teacher? Perdón. 31. Unit 3. Okay. Ya te digo. Okay, do you have a, some, some of the rules in your workplace? One moment. No tienen ninguna. Yes? Should? Yeah. Shouldn't? No tienen ninguna. I should. Oh, no. Huh? Uh, we should greet all the people. Mm. Repeat? I'm sorry? You should. No, teacher. Uh, we. We're practicing the, the conversation. conversation. The conversation. Okay, so if you practice it two, three times, excellent. Now go to exercise three. Okay. What are some polite behaviors you expect from your coworkers? So I thought you should. The first one is you should. Number two, what are some rude behaviors that your coworkers okay. are not expected to do? That means you shouldn't. You shouldn't. You should grade the, our people. En el tres. tres. Número tres. Discutir, dicen. What are some polite behaviors you, you expect from you, co-workers? Entonces serían cuáles son las modales o principios de cortesía que esperamos de nuestros compañeros de trabajo. Y, what are some rules? Uy, esa de rude no puse atención que era rude. Should, shouldn't. What are some things you should do at your work? For example, do you have to wear a mask? Yes? yes. You should wear a mask. Yes. Ahí está una. Okay? okay. Maybe yes. it can puede ser negativo. You shouldn't. Okay? You shouldn't come to work if you are sick. Uh -huh. okay? okay? So tell me, what are some rules that you have in your work? Uh, uh, one... You should wash your hands uh, about 30 minutes. Okay, minutes? No, seconds. Minutes, seconds, seconds. Uh -huh. Sec minutes seria minutos, seconds, 30 seconds. Okay, very good. You That's should what? use you sh you should use Google's Google's in uh -huh. in the plan. 
Ok, do you know what uh, goggles, se dice goggles, <laughs> goggles, goggles. Do, you, goggles. do you know what that is, goggles. Harold? Do you understand what that is? ¿Qué es goggles? Goggles. Eh, lentes. Yes. Goggles. Huh? Goggles. To, to protect ourselves, right? Yes. Y la otra es should not wear. Mm -hmm. La otra puede ser you should not. Eh, ¿Cómo sería? Estar cerca. Como no, no, no podemos estar cerca de dos metros de distancia. Uh -huh. Eso. Sería, ¿Cuál vas a usar? ¿Should o shouldn't? Eh, shouldn't. Uh -huh. Era como de no estar. Uh -huh. Correct. You should not. You shouldn't be. Ay, como cerca. Cerca sin nada. You should not be close. You should not be close mm -hmm. to the matters of. ¿Y cómo, cómo se diría? Matters, uh -huh. Menos de dos metros de distancia. Less than. Less, less than. And then. Two meters. Two meters. Mm -hmm. Less than two meters. Two meters. Two meters. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You should not be less than two meters. Mm -hmm. sí. You should use a call help. Very good. Um, you should check mm -hmm. your temperature. You should take or you should check, check your, your corporal temperature. No sé. Temperature. Temperature. Mm -hmm. You should check. The corporal temperature. Very good. Okay, good job. What else? You should not run. You should not run. Okay, very good. You should not run. In work. Okay. Work. Good, good. Okay. Otro puede ser, you should not use the equipment to personal things. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You should not use the equipment for, for. personal things. Yes, very good. Good job. Excellent. Okay, very good. Yeah, ya vamos a regresar. Continue. Try to think maybe of two or three more. Okay. You should use the uniform. Mm -hmm. Com oh, com uniform complete or complete uniform? Complete uniform. You should not use tennis. Tennis shoes. Mm -hmm. Tennis shoes. Yes. Very good. You should sanitize. 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 Mm -hmm. uh, you personal. Okay, very good. 
So we're going to continue to practice that section, okay? We're going to, later on, we're going to do a project. The project is where you're going to make a, a manual, a handbook. A manual, like, for example, a, uh, rules in your workplace, all right? Van a crear un reglamento ustedes, basically, okay? Using should and should not, okay? Let me show you some pictures. Uh, well, the, no, I have a video for you. Let me show you a video that I have, okay? And it's, it's funny, okay? But it's something that you shouldn't do. So let me, let me share the video with you. Wait. Okay, so you ready? You want to see? <laughs> this is a funny video, right? No sé si lo han visto anteriormente, but uh, it's, it's funny. This is a person. Yes. In, in the workplace, okay? Okay, very good. All right, I have one more, one more, hold on. Let's check out this guy. <laughs> Get angry. <laughs> okay. All right, very good. So he is more temperamental. ¿Qué le podemos dar a él? Advice. Recommendations. Okay? So uh, give me a recommendation. Or put it on the chat. ¿Qué le podemos decir ahí a los, a, a los trabajadores esos? Make a recommendation. Should or shouldn't? Put it on the chat. Should. Pueden usar cualquiera de las dos. Ahí. Whatever you want to use, but make a recommendation. You should not distress. Okay, put it on the chat. Write it. Very good. Danilo le dijera al brother, you should take a vacation. Excellent. Good job. You should you need a vacation. You should take a vacation. You should not less the head. Uh, lose. Lose the head, Francisco. Lose. Perder, right? L se escribe L-O-S-S. -S. No, um, L. Uh, David, you should be patient. Okay, very good. Carla, you should not mistreat the work team. Okay, very good. Uh, Luis, you should not act like this. Very good. Harold, you should not lose your patience. Very good. Francisco, you should not lose the head yet. All right, very good. Uh, what else? Crisia, you should not stress. Very good. Carla, you, say, you, should, you should prepare your work more carefully. Okay, very good. You should not stress. Very good, Oli. Ma Maynard, you should take care of the company equipment. Very good. You should medication. Después de should, tenemos que usar un verbo. Allí, Oli, ¿cuál podría ser? ¿Qué verbo podría ser? Um, you should, and you then you need, should. you need a verb, right? Okay. Um, 
como recomendar, recomendar medicación, eh, meditación. Ajá, pero le estás diciendo a él que haga algo, le estás dando como una instrucción. So, you should what? Um, I, tomar. I tomar. A tomar. Yeah. ¿Cómo se dice tomar en inglés? Take. Take. Uh -huh. Very good. Sería, eh, you should take med med meditation. Yes, that's correct. Very good. Danilo, you should go visit a massage place with a happy final, okay? You should calm down, relax. Very good, Maria. You should not be crazy. Very good, excellent, good job, okay? Excellent recommendations, excellent. Okay, very good. Let's go back to the book. Uh, eh, this is, creo que estamos on page 31, right? Yeah, page 31, okay. Definition of this word, very important word that we're going to use, behavior. Repeat, behavior. 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 Very good. Okay. What does it mean? The way that someone acts in different situations. The way someone acts in different situations. Okay. For example, here. ¿Cómo la podemos usar esa palabra in a sentence? For example. Ah, perdón. Let me share. Okay. Ahora sí va. Ahora sí pueden ver. Okay, very good. The word here that we want to use is behavior. Okay? Si, si se pueden poner en mute, si hay mucho, mucho ruido a su alrededor, por favor. Si se pueden poner en mute. Gracias. Eh, behavior, the way someone acts in different situations. Okay? Let's see. Luis, read the first one, sentence number one. How to use behavior in a sentence. The company expects polite behavior from all the employees. Very good, Luis. Okay, excellent. The company expects polite behavior from all the employees. Very good. Let's see. Uh, David, read number two. Interrupt. Interrupting other people when they speak is not a good behavior. Behavior. Very good. Behavior. Aquí hay una V pequeña que tenés que hacer. Eh, no sé si me pueden ver en la cámara, pero lo que haces es que eh, vas a sacar los dientes de, de enfrente y te vas a morder un poquito el labio de abajo. Behavior. Behavior. Como decir, Victor. Behavior. Behavior. Yes, very good. It's a, it's a small V. V pequeña. Very good. Number three, gossip. Let's see, Carla, uh, read sentence number three. About Welcome. Carla Maria, sorry. Okay. <laughs> sorry. Because I think about the co-workers is rude behavior. Very good. Repeat, gossiping. Gossiping. Mm -hmm. What is gossiping? Mm, como chismear. Yes, very good. Right? Chismear. Excellent. Gossiping <laughs> about co-workers is rude behavior. Okay? Rude is negative, right? It's bad. It's another way of saying bad behavior. All right, very good. Let me show you a quick presentation that I have that we can see, okay? I'm going to show you a picture. Hey, let's go back. No, it's not this one, not this one. <laughs> Let me show you a picture. And you're going to give me a recommendation, okay? Should and should not. Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, Instagram, 
something that you should or shouldn't do at work? Shouldn't. Should not. Shouldn't. Huh? Shouldn't. You shouldn't what? Should not use. Should not. Should not. Should Mm -hmm. Shooting, shooting and disparar. <laughs> no, should or should not. Should, should. Yo quiero que me den una recomendación. Give me a recommendation. Así como me está, estaban haciendo los ejemplos de ustedes. You should, you should, use, use, you should use Facebook for business. You should use Facebook for business, okay? ¿Qué más? You should not use um, Instagram mm -hmm. in the office. Very good. You should not use Insta Instagram in the office. Very good. Alguien más? Alguien más tiene otro? Uh -huh. You should be a YouTube new business. You should use, usar, you should use, see? ¿sí? Yes. Usar. You should use YouTube in your business. Yes. Mm -hmm. Like uh, marketing. Okay, yes. Okay, very good. Okay, let me give you another, another picture. Look at this. You should or you shouldn't? You shouldn't what? Should not. You should not what? Give me a recommendation. You shouldn't be angry. You should not be angry. Okay, good. You should, you should not what? You should, you should not is furious. You should not get furious it gets at work. Furious. Very good. Okay, another picture. You should, should not. You, you should, you should, no, you should so much is a rude behavior. Mm, no, I, I, I don't know. Uh, you need you a verb. Should, you should, you should sh not you should gossip. Gossip. You should not speak in the air. ¿Se acuerda? Acabamos de ver la, la definición de chis chismear. ¿Se acuerda? Gossip. You should not. Be gossiping. You should not be gossiping, okay? Or you should not gossip. Gossip. Remember? Acabamos de ver la palabra gossip. You gossip. should not gossip. Very good. What about this one? Sleep. You should, you should not sleep. Should not sleep. sleep. Uh, you sleep. Sleep. The the world. Office time. Very good. You should should be working or sleep office mm -hmm. time. Very good. I heard a lot of different opinions. Okay. Creo que todos tienen la idea correcta, right? Remember, after should, you have to use a verb. You should not sleep. What about this one? You should not. You should not hit during working hours. Okay, good. good, good, good job. What about this one? Can you see here? Customer service. You should not listen to music. Okay, you should not listen to music at work. Okay. All right, very good. Look at, look at this one. You should not be regular. Oh. <laughs> use the cell phone. You should not, not use the cell phone. Okay, good. And what about this picture? Fight. You should not fight. You should not fight mm -hmm. in the office. The you office. should not fight in the work. Very good, okay. Oh, oh, yes. y, y aquí estaba le, the brother that, that broke the computer, the video, remember? All you right. You should not compete. You should not what? Después de should not, ¿te acuerdan? Necesitamos un verbo. You should not. You should not. Um, how do you say comportamiento, teacher? You should not behave. 
behave. You should not behave, for example. Mm -hmm. No, but I you know. The, uh -huh. Repeat. You should. You shouldn't break the computer. You shouldn't break. Porque break es el pasado. Break. Uh, present. That's correct. Break. Yes, very good. Okay. Hey, ¿Se han dado cuenta de una cosa? Que toda la comunicación necesitamos un verbo. Okay. Remember yesterday, estábamos usando could you. Y después necesitamos un verbo. Could you print the magazine? Could you give me a second? Could you help me? Si recuerden, siempre cuando estamos comunicándonos, vamos a usar un verbo. Right? So, por eso les mandé esa lista de verbos. Ok? Se los mandé al WhatsApp. Ahí está la lista. Right? Es, es sencilla. No son todos los verbos en el inglés, pero sí les puede ayudar para iniciar. Ok? So, take the list. Look at the verbs. In the simple present and the past. Look at the verbs. Ok? Estudien un poquito. Ok? No, no esperen solamente aquí estas dos horas. Y aquí el teacher me va a enseñar todos los verbos del inglés. No, no, you know, it's not, not going to happen. You have to be active learning, okay? No sean pasivos que solo van a venir aquí y van a estar en la, en la reunión. No, sean activos, okay? So study, study on your own. All right, very good. So let's go now, let's go back to the book. What are we going to do? We're going to do a little project. But before I do the project, okay? Creo que ya entendieron bien el, el uso de should and shouldn't, okay? Pero aquí hay otros ejemplos. All right? Si no entienden, levanten la mano. Okay? Porque ya van a hacer la actividad de ustedes. All right, look at exercise number five. Look at the words in bold and complete the sentence below. The, the guard should answer my, my good morning greeting. Okay? Aquí estoy poniendo un sujeto adelante. Lo pueden hacer también. De hecho, lo han hecho cuando dicen you should. You should, están poniendo un sujeto adelante, al inicio. Linda should greet with a firm handshake. The supervisor should use a greeting in his emails. You should say please when you ask for a favor. Okay? Now, should, como lo usamos, aquí está la estructura, all right? And we use should plus an infinitive form or the base verb, okay? So, eso es lo que estamos usando ahorita, el base verb, okay? Plus any complement in the phrase, okay? What do we use it for? We use it to give a direct suggestion. Una sugerencia directa, direct suggestion, okay? Look at the examples of should not. Darío should not use many emojis in his emails. Helen should not speak so loudly. Gabriel should not tell sexist jokes. Okay. Your boss should not sh shout at you. Okay. So the same thing. We use it to suggest something, sugerir algo, que no es apropiado. That is not appropriate. Okay. All right. Questions. The grammar. Should. And should not. Alguna pregunta. Okay. Carlos, yes. the assistant. Ah, assistant. Yes. Ah, yeah. I guess I'm going to be But today we're going to do it right now before we go on. Uh, before we go to the activity, we're going to do it. Thank you. Thank you, Oli. Okay, very good. So, what are you going to do? ¿Qué van a hacer? The project that we're going to do, okay? Ex sorry. Uh, you're going to do exercise number six and seven together, okay? Six and seven. Lo van a hacer junto, in groups, okay? Exercise number six, it says, provide a suggestion about the next situation at work. Okay, le están dando un situation. Un escenario, un scenario, okay? And you have to make a suggestion, okay? Ahí está el, suggest, el, el escenario, qué es lo que está pasando, y ustedes van a hacer una suggestion, okay? Uh, lo pueden hacer en negativo, positivo, should, shouldn't, okay? However you want to say it, 
All right. No lo voy a leer porque quiero que ustedes lo lean en, en su grupo. All right. Then, the next activity that you're going to do, okay, uh, what you're going to do next is, this is what I want. Uh, después, vamos a dejar el 7 para después, but what I want you to do is make a list of rules in your work that you can use, okay? Una lista por grupo. All right, rules, maybe 10, 10 rules that you should use at work. Okay, so trabajen juntos, van a hacer una lista. Okay, very good. Después, cuando tengamos esa lista, vamos a compartir exercise number seven. Okay, very good. Questions? So, mamá said exercise number six, and then we're going to do the list of 10 rules. Okay, and then the de ahí vamos a hacer a little presentation in the class. Questions? Preguntas? Okay. Después no le estén preguntando a su compañero. Ask me now, please, if you don't understand. Okay. Attendance. Uh, let's go back to the session. Jaime Alexander. Uh, hold on a sec. Jaime Alexander, no. Okay. Uh, Danilo. Danilo Alfredo. And he was here. I saw him. Carla Stephanie. Hey, teacher. Uh, I see you, Danilo. And Carla Stephanie. Present. I see you. Uh, Luis Gustavo. Present teacher. Alba Nubia. No le escucho Alba. Present, present teacher. Okay, thank you. David Antonio. Present teacher. Harold Alexander. Present teacher. Francisco Javier. Present teacher. Ana Romelia. Eh, María, María Sonia. Present teacher. Carla María. Present teacher. Crisia. Present teacher. Okay. Omar Arturo. Eh, Oli. Present teacher. Minor. Present teacher. Pablo Ernesto. Present. And Manuel Alberto. Okay, very good. All right. Let's go now to, let's do exercise. Uh, it was exercise number six. After that exercise, hagan una lista ustedes de diez, ten rules, okay? And then we're going to share in the class, okay? Very good. So let's go to the groups. Okay, accept the invitation, please. Uh, hello, Omar. I'm going to put you in a group, okay? Uh, accept the invitation to go to the group. Ambos podíamos ocupar. Okay. okay, very good. I send you a picture in WhatsApp of the exercise, exercise number six. Okay? Okay, teacher. Okay. If you don't Ambos, have podemos to... ocupar. Ambos podemos ocupar, ¿verdad, teacher? Um, ¿El qué? ¿Cómo? Um, 
Shouldn't. Ah, see, uh huh, uh huh. Should and shouldn't. Correct. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, but look, look at exercise number six, right? You have to read. Qué es lo que está pasando allí, and then make a recommendation. Okay. okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks. El, uh, exercise six. El two recuadro. When Carlos Car when Car is angry or things are not as uh, he expects, he shows shows. Lo escribimos. Dice Peter, he's the new supervisor. He likes to hide to hide order. He never say please. Number one. Peter. Peter Charlie has 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 policy request. Peter Charlie say please when he has for some time. Okay, so there's a problem there, right? For number two. Ya leyeron? Yes. Okay. Yes. Let's, let's do number two. Yo no sé. Yo no lo voy a hacer. Ustedes lo van a hacer. When okay. Peter Chorty has police policy. Eh, please, when he has for time. Esa ya la hicieron. So let's do number two. Yeah. Eh, eh, yo estoy. Eh, yo le estoy dando forma. Es así entonces. Ajá. Uh -huh. Solo okay. que la una ya le dieron el ejemplo, ¿verdad? So eh, let's, sí. Let's do number two. Yes. Number when, two, when, when Carl is angry, is angry or uh -huh. seen are not as he expects, he is so. Shouts. So, what? Shouts. 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 Okay. What is, what is shouts? I don't know. Scream. Okay. Do you understand, Alba? Yes. Okay. So what, what recommendation can you give him? Mm. Do you understand, Alba, the word shouts? Do you understand the meaning, shouts? Uh, Alba? Happy, uh, 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 Es que, es que le estoy Carl dando... eh, es angry, ¿verdad? Enojado. Uh -huh. um, when Carl is eh, happy, como llega solo enojado, vamos a decir que, que llegue feliz. No, ahí, ahí no está diciendo feliz. When no, Carl... La... Uh -huh. I know. Uh -huh. I know, dice angry. Uh -huh. I can... Uh, When okay. Se la voy is, a leer. Per permíteme leerla. Okay. When okay. Carl is angry or things are not as he expects, he shouts. Do you understand, Alba? Shouts? Yes. Scream. Uh -huh. So, mm -hmm. what is your recommendation for him? What is your recommendation for him? Okay. Yes, eso es lo que van a hacer. Okay. Right. When Carlo, when Car is slow, is is slow, um, or Dean is happy, had yes, but the, he's so. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm, no. ¿Cuál sería la no. recomendación usando should or should not? Should not, should not. Sería when Carlos Jordan is happy. Happening. Mm -hmm. You have to happy. give me a recommendation. ¿Se acuerdan yeah. lo que estábamos haciendo en clase? You should. Uh -huh. Yes. You when so. Carlos and when Carlos Surely is happy. 
or Dean as the he expected his show. Uh -huh. Yes. Esa, ajá. ¿Cuál es la recomendación que tú le vas a dar a, a Carl? Ok. Que sea, eh, que sea feliz. O que okay. sea... ¿Sí? Ok. So, should. You're going to use should. Es que no lo puedo pronunciar. Sure. Carlos, no sure. No lo puedo pronunciar bien yo, pero sería when Carlos is what uh, sure or be happy. Eh, escríbala en el chat. Quiero verla. Write it in the chat. Ok. Alba, escribe su recomendación en el chat. Write it on, on the chat so that I can see. I want to see. Okay, when car is sure or happiness as he expects, he shouts. No, esa no es la estructura que estamos usando. Mm -mm. No. No. ¿Tiene ahí el libro? Ya. Yeah. ¿Puede ver el ejercicio 5? ¿Sí? Ya. Yeah. Ok. Leemos, leamos, por eh, ejemplo, el, el ejemplo donde dice should not, Darío should not. Darío should not use money and money. In his email. Uh -huh. okay. Okay. I, I, okay. Helen, read that example. Helen. Helen should not speak in so loudly. Okay. Entonces, lo primero que tenemos en la estructura es el sujeto. Exacto. Exactly. Después tenemos should or should not. Okay. Y después tenemos un verbo base. Y después tenemos un complemento. Okay. So, uh, your example, for example, eh, tú estás empezando when Carl, no es necesario empezar con when. So, quitemos when. No, no va el verb to be is después del nombre Carl. Ok. Okay. Alba, ¿está ahí? No, sí, estoy, tra estoy trabajando. Usted, usted se esconde a través de la computadora. Usted se esconde mucho. Ay, yo, yo quiero, y es que yo no quiero. No puedo mucho, yo no puedo mucho. Okay. Carlos. Vale, ve ahí lo que le escribí. Ca Carlos, show me or happening as he expected no. he told. Okay. So, Oli, después de should, call should, ¿qué va después okay. de should? Should. En la estructura. Not us. En, en lo que yo estaba leyendo. Ajá. Si vas a usar okay. el negativo, ¿vas a usar el negativo o el positivo? No, positivo. Okay. Positive. Okay. Entonces, después del de should, ¿qué va? Fíjate en los ejemplos que están al otro lado. Los primeros ejemplos en la tabla, los que están hacia la izquierda. Ok. Sholding grits with firm hat. Ok. So, después de should, ¿qué va? Un verbo, un verbo base. Un verbo base. Dale Fíjate, en tu, en tu ejemplo, tú me diste Carl should y después de should no pusiste un verbo base. No. Entonces, entonces la estructura no está correcta. Okay, Carlos. Ve ahí, ve eh, lo que escribí yo. Ok, Alba, Carlos. Carlos, Carlos, should, should not. No, entonces no está usando la estructura porque después del sujeto, ¿qué va? Should. No, ahí tiene dos, dos sujetos al mismo tiempo. Tiene Carlos y tiene you. 
los dos son sujetos. Ah, no puede, no pueden ir el juntos. Nombre. Entonces solo deja el nombre. Carlos should not. Después de not, necesito un verbo, Alba. Ahí me lo dio en el segundo ejemplo, ya lo veo. Carlos should not get mad. Entonces, lo único que tiene que quitarle allí, Alba, es el doble sujeto que puso. You. Uh -huh. sí. Correct, correct. Very good. Okay. Oli, do you understand? Uh, yes, Odita. Okay. No me deja, no me deja las uñas. Es que, okay. es, es que miren, por eso es importante que entiendan la estructura y por eso yo digo, ¿alguien tiene pregunta de la estructura? Es que yo no entré al principio, entré no, tarde sí. y eso a mí me afectó. Oh, okay. pero, Carlos, pero, entré tarde. Pero vio, <risa> no, yo sé, yo sé que entró tarde, pero usted vio ese ejercicio 5, ese lo, ese lo hice junto. Sí. Antes de la, de la asistencia, ¿se acuerda? Sí, no. Entonces, sí, yes, yes. entonces sí estaba en la asistencia. Entonces, <ríe> yo, sí. yo quiero que me pregunten, por favor, levanten la mano. You okay. should, sí. right? Y después de should viene un verbo. Entonces, eso es lo que quería que entendieran, que después de should viene un verbo base, ¿ok? Ok. El cual ahorita les está costando porque no entendieron esa parte. All right, very no. good. So, practice, ¿ok? Ya hicieron el número uno. Sí, el número eh, dos. Carlos Scholz uh -huh. de Be Happening. Uh -huh. Yes. Be. Mm, Carlos no. should be happy as he yes. expects he shouts. Mm, sí, pero tengo una pregunta. Carlos should be happy. Uh -huh. eh, eh, lo que está diciendo es Carlos debería estar contento mientras Exacto. él. Grita. Ah, no, eso, lo, I... eso, eso es lo que está diciendo. Ok. Carlos okay. should be happy. Ahí está bien. Should be happy. Y hasta ahí puedes decirlo. Carlos should be happy. Ok. Y ahí está okay. la recomendación. Ok. Ok. Thank. Thank. Ok. All right. Hey, ¿Qué más le podemos decir a Carlos? Por ejemplo, I could say, you should relax. ¿Se acuerdan? Cuando vieron yes. el video, video de la persona que estaba quebrando la computadora. Sí. ¿Vio ese video, Alba? Sí. ¿Vieron sí. las recomendaciones que nos estaban dando los compañeros en el chat? Sí. Es lo mismo, yeah. estamos haciendo lo mismo. He should take a vacation. He should take a break. He shouldn't get angry. Okay. Very good. Ahí está. Very good, Oli. Call should be calm. Very good. Okay. Ahí está la estructura. ¿Ok? O sea que nos complicamos nosotros demasiado entonces, Carlos. Mm. Queremos armar mucho o no cortamos, quizás. No está. ¿Se acuerda que la gramática es como una... Es como la guía, esos zapitos que cuando vamos manejando... Que Exacto. Están esos zapitos Exacto. ahí al lado. Entonces, yes. ustedes, ustedes no están en, dentro de los zapitos. Okay. okay, very Okay, thank. All right, very good. Continue. My Hello, hello. How are you? How are you doing? Hello. Hello, hello. Okay, do you have some recommendations? Yes. Did you finish exercise 6? Yes. Yes. Uh, what, okay, I'm going to read it. You give me a recommendation. Number 2. When Carl is angry or things are not as he expects, he shouts. He should calm down and think very well. Very good. Uh huh. What about you? Uh, do you have an, another recommendation for him, uh, Pablo? The two. Solo hicieron una. Yes, only one for the group. Okay. Podrían pensar en otra. Another one that you can you can ask him. Ah, uh, okay. Let me see. 
¿Se acuerdan la, la persona que estaba quebrando la compu? <laughs> right? Yes. Remember? In the video. Carl Gus waits for the angel to pass. Uh, can you repeat, please, Paul? Carl Gus wait for the angel to pass. Mm, uh, should, right? Carl should wait. Oh, okay, yes, yes. yes. Okay. Carl just should mm -hmm. wait for the angel to pass. Yes, very good. Carl should wait for the anger to pass. Yeah. Very good. Okay, next one. Next one says, my assistant never uses a salutation in her emails. Your assistant should uses a salutation in the emails. Very good, okay, good job. What about you, Pablo? Your assistant should always place to salute. Salutation. Salutation. Mm -hmm. Salutation. Very good, good job, okay. And the next one is, Lucy likes to tell jokes in the office. She, she louds very loudly. Creo que hay un error. It should be she shouts or she speaks very loudly. Okay. Lucy tells jokes yes, in the office. I she think. speaks. Yo creo que ahí tiene que ser speak. She speaks very loudly. Hmm? Mm -hmm. What do you think? Because loud and loud is like the same. Sí, sí. Loud. Loud is uh, el volumen, right? So, el tono de, volumen. de volumen. Loudly is eh, audiblemente o fuertemente, right? Mm -hmm. So, yeah, that, that's a mistake. You should say yes. speak or talk. What okay, do you think? In that case, she shouldn't tell jokes in the office and try to not be loudly. Very good. Very good. Lucy shouldn't tell jokes in the office. Okay. Yes. And Very try good. to not be loud. Uh -huh. Very good. Good job. What else? Lucy should not be joking around the office. Okay. Good. Good. Good job. All right. Now, after this, what you can do now is make a list of 10 rules that you have in your workplace, okay? Yes. Okay. Okay, work on that. And then, tenganla por ahí escrita, and then you're going to present in the class. Okay. okay. So, not speak. So low. So low. Lowly. Or low. No, solo low. <laughs> Should I speak it, speak it low? Quiero ver otra recomendación que podamos poner. Lucy. Um, O podríamos reemplazar para cambiar, ¿verdad? no poner solo Lucy, podríamos poner um, ella, por ejemplo, she. Si sí se puede hacer así, sí, teacher. Sí, se puede. Sí, se puede. Yes, you can say she. Yes. She should. She should. Mm -hmm. She should not. No. Pero los uh, verbos, o sea, si hablamos de tercera persona, igual siempre se usan, así se usan normales, ¿verdad? Eh, los verbos, ah, sí, solamente eh, hay una regla, simple present, presente, tercera persona, le pones una S. For example, she works in Walmart. Works. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Es la única regla. She works, uh, she talks, she talks very loud. 
Ajá, la pones una S en el verbo. Simple present. Ok. Only. Por ejemplo, Pero, digamos, es, esta oración que dice, eh, Lucy should not speak so low. Entonces sería speak o... o no, speak ahí, hay un er, speak. ahí hay un error. Eh, ya me acabo de dar cuenta, ahí hay un error. Eh, debería de ser speak or talk. Uh -huh. Porque si ustedes ven eh, loud, she louds very loudly. No, eso no tiene sentido. She speaks. Uh -huh. Speaks with the S. Uh -huh. Debería tener una S. She speaks be, very loudly. Ajá, para que, diga, que ella habla muy fuerte. Uh -huh. Correct. Uh -huh. Ah, ok. Entonces She también speaks. Lucy show not acts that uh -huh. way. Sería también con la S, ¿verdad? Act. Uh -huh. She should not. No, solamente que aquí no, no aplica esa regla porque estás usando un eh, modal verb. Eh, no aplica esa regla porque estamos usando estos, estos modal verbs que son como you have to, should, could, todo este tipo de modal verbs. So no, no aplica esa regla específica. Por eso, ajá. entonces acá los verbos se ocupan normales. Uh -huh. Aunque sí. hablemos de tercera persona. Uh -huh. Sí, en el caso de esto, de este, esta estructura de should, yes. Normal base verb. Uh -huh. okay. okay, entonces, Carla sería, she show not. Um, she show not. No, no sé, ella no debería. También puede ser Lucy, so work more. Uh -huh. eh, recommendation for her. She shouldn't tell jokes at work. Podría ser. Shouldn't. Shouldn't. No, no, le, no le escuché muy bien, Ticha, disculpe. Lucy, Lucy shouldn't tell jokes at work. Shouldn't. Shouldn't text at work. Shouldn't tell jokes. Tell jokes. Tell jokes. Tell jokes. Tell jokes. Si se dan cuenta, estoy usando lo mismo que está en la oración ahí. Solo que le pongo Lucy shouldn't. Lucy shouldn't tell uh, jokes in the office. Jokes. The office. Y en vez de ser the office, somos a work. Uh, correct. You can, however, however you want. You can say okay. both. Lucy shouldn't not. Uh, I work. Okay. Uh, dijo teacher que eran 10 de cada una. No comprendí mal. No, no, vaya. Este primer ejercicio. Okay. Uh -huh. Aquí solo uh -huh. tiene que dar una, one recommendation. Uh, but now you have to, you finish with this, now you have to make a rule. Try to make maybe 10 rules that you have in your work. Make a list. Make a list. Nosotros hicimos. Ya hicieron una lista. Cinco, en otros hicimos tres, en otros hicimos cuatro. Fueron como once por todo. Ah, ok, ok. Ustedes hicieron como cuatro por cada uno. All right. All right. Very good. Entonces, what you can do is take those and just make one list. Okay. Como si fueran eh, el reglamento de una mm -hmm. empresa o algo así. Yes, correct. Mm -hmm. Like, a, remember I told you, like a, like a manual, like a, a rule book. Mm -hmm. Okay. Bueno, entonces puede ser... You should know tell jokes in the office. Ahí está, hay que ver el primero. Si no te ha perdido la voz tampoco. Mm -hmm. Very good. Remember, remember the gossip? You should not. Gossip. Gossip. 
-hmm. Do you remember? Ya se te olvidó lo que era gossip, Luis. Sí, bueno, la estoy pensando que ahí a la parte de aquí de esta. Gossip? Do you remember? Do you remember que era gossip? Um, ¿Qué era gossip, Carlos? Chambre. ¿Ah? Chambre. Yes. Uh, you should not gossip. Uh -huh. I was going to go for the gossip girls. Entonces. Uh -huh. Very good. Okay, ten, ten minutes and then we're going to go back. Okay, I'll give you ten minutes to finish. Ten minutes. Sería, you should not. Bromas, ¿cómo se dice usted? Ahorita. Joik. Joik. Okay. Joik, ajá. Eh, creo que ya terminamos, no sé si eh, hace más eh, Ok, finish. Yeah, finish this. Ok, eh, hicieron exercise 6. Did you finish exercise 6? Yes. Yeah. Ok, and then did you make a list of 10 rules? La lista de 10 reglas, did you do that? No. No, Entonces solo han hecho el 6. Exercise six. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Now, uh, after this, okay, make a rule, make como como un manual de reglas, like ten rules. Ah, okay. Okay. Very good. Make make a rules. Ten rules. Uh, uh, independientemente el, el lugar, trabajo, casa. A work, work. A work, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. First, eh, primera regla. Podría ser, bueno, la que yo tenía. Ahorita eh, sería. You should be at work eh, temprano para no poner una hora en específica. Time more. ¿Cómo? Time more. <laughs> Ay, se ha descargado mucho. Mm, Permítame tiempo. que se me perdió la página. Ah, pero es que eso no está en el libro, ¿verdad? Eh, ¿Las reglas o al qué? Ajá, las reglas. Sí, o sea, hay unos ejemplos que podemos tomar. Ajá, pero... Um, quiero ver... Temprano, pero que temprano, no sé si temprano. No, 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 no. Okay, you should, you should. Recommendation there. What's the number one rule? You should. Teacher, how, uh, how do you say temprano? Early. 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 Mm -hmm. Early. Okay, very good. To show me early. early. Okay. Otra otra regla que podíamos tener. Yeah, you should get the get to the office early, early, algo así. Mm -hmm. You should get to the office early. Día mm -hmm. vamos a hacer de ese, teacher. Yes, ten rules. Okay, cinco okay. y cinco. Okay. Ten rules. Five minutes, five minutes. Thank five. you, teacher. Okay, okay. Una regla sería tal vez no comer. ¿No comer durante eh, el trabajo? 
O durante el tiempo de trabajo. Yes. Okay. In English. Uh, um, you should not. Yeah. You should not eat yes. during uh, work. You should not eat at the work table. ¿Cómo va, Alex? Alex, dos. Ah, okay. You should work in, in team. Okay. You should work in teams. David. Hola. Um, sería, bueno, yo tengo una. Uh, you should not eat food while, while working. While working. Ajá, es. Mm -hmm. ¿Cómo es, teacher? Eh, while. 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 Ah, ok. Mm -hmm. <laughs> ok, Very thank you. Repite, eh, María. Mari, <laughs> Mari. um, Alex, you, ¿estás ahí? You quiet. should not sí, sí, eat Estoy trabajando, tratando de sacar una de las que... Ok, yo tengo una. Uh, <coughs> dice, it, it should be more effective in its work. Ok, you should be more effective in work, en el trabajo. Yes. In its work. Yeah. In, in, dentro. In, in work. Ok, y el it... ITS? No, it's not necessary. You should be more effective in work. In work. Ok, ok. Eh, otra más sería. Eh, you should respect the boss. The boss. Mm -hmm. Ah, muy bien. Al, al jefe. Work. Uh -huh. Sí. Yo llevo cuatro, oh, I, I have, or sentences, show. You, María, Alexander. Yo tengo una nada más, <coughs> iría con la segunda. Uh, how many, how many have? María. María. Creo que tuvo que. Sí, 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 creo que se levantó. Um, debería ser. Um, debería ser más amable con los clientes. You should be. Respect. Ok, en inglés. Eh, al. You should uh, be more mm, respect or respectar. Friendly. <laughs> ¿Se le olvidó la estructura, Alex? Eh, tratando de armarla. No, ya, eh, ya sí armó una. ¿Cómo armó la primera? Ok, bueno. eh, utilizándola. Eh, eh, should be more. Y acá sería, eh, should be nice, ser agradable, amable. You should eh, be, you should be like, do, do you remember the word that we learned today? No, eh, tú acabas de ingresar, pero este, creo sí, que sí. los demás estaban ahí. Do you remember? Ok, very good. Now, 
Exercise number six was answering the questions there. Exercise, the next exercise was making a list. ¿Cuántos hicieron una lista de diez? Diez suggestions, ten suggestions. Okay. So, tenían que hacer una, una lista de diez después de completar el ejercicio seis. Sí. Okay. All right. Very good. Uh, Luis, si te puedes poner en mute, please, just for a second. Okay. I'm going to show you a presentation very quickly. Okay. Look at the, the one that I have for you here. I have a, a presentation. Uh, rules for meetings. Learning rules for meetings. Okay. Esto les puede ayudar. Aplíquenlo for learning English, the meetings here, our class. You should have your book available. Algunos no tienen el libro. Ya vamos por la mitad del curso y todavía no tienen el libro. You should have your book available. Number one, it's going to help you for learning. You should be on time. You should be punctual. You should be on time. Okay? ¿Qué hora empieza la reunión? Eight. Eight through ten. Next, you should find a nice, cozy spot to have your meeting. Not find a nice spot. ¿Qué quiere decir nice, cozy? Cómodo, comfortable. Nice. Donde me siento cómodo. You should find a nice spot to have your meeting. Okay? It's going to be very difficult if you're driving. That's not comfortable. Okay? Busquen un rinconcito, su cama. Right? Look for a nice spot. You should not be afraid to ask for help. If you don't understand, ask. Ask for help. Teacher, I don't understand. Teacher, I did. I don't understand this question. I don't understand what we're doing. Acabo de venir. Teacher, I don't understand what we're doing. Ask. You should not be afraid to ask for help. Next. You should raise your hand if you have any doubts. No se quedan con la duda. Right? Porque después viene la actividad y no la están haciendo. You can't complete the task. You should raise your hand if you have any doubts. Okay? Aquí hay una opción para levantar la mano aquí en Zoom, ¿verdad? ¿Ya la encontraron? ¿Dónde dice? Raise hand. Okay? Use it. Yes. If you, if you have any questions, raise your hand. Okay? You should read the lesson before the class. ¿Cuántos están haciendo eso? Leyendo la lección antes de venir a la clase. Medio leyendo. Right? Skimming. No tienen que completar todo el ejercicio. No. Just read the lesson before the class. ¿Cuántos hacen eso? Leen la lección antes. Deberían. De. You should. You should. Read the lesson before the class. You should be organized with your work. Organized with your work. Right? All your responsibilities. You should be organized. Okay? Yo también estoy estudiando, so I'm learning English. Right? Estoy sacando una, un certificado de Estados Unidos. Se llama TEFL. TEFL. Teaching English as a Foreign Language. Estoy sacando una certificación de Estados Unidos de allá para poder enseñar en otros países. You should be organized with your work. Okay? You should be organized with your time. Yes? Very important. You should be organized with your time. Another thing. You should be proactive and independent when you study English. Okay? So, pueden estudiar por su propia cuenta, right? Pueden, no solo dependan del, del teacher aquí, sino que sean proactivos. Be proactive. Be independent when you're studying English, right? 
So, pueden buscar recursos, pueden leer el libro antes, you can, uh, all, all the worksheets that we do in class, you can do those. Okay. Ahora le mandé una lista de verbos, verbs, simple past, present, and past participle, verbs. I send you a list. Look at the list, review it. Look at it. Go. Tomen cinco que van a aprender al día, cinco al día, cinco verbs. I'm going to learn five verbs every day in English. Simple present and simple past. Okay? Eso es ser proactivo. You should be proactive and independent. Finally, you should be present in the video conference, right? Very good. So, that's my recommendations. Quiero escuchar la suya. Ready? Let's go. Who's going to start? Who's going to go? Recommendations will work. Okay? En cinco minutos vamos a tomar la asistencia otra vez, pero we have 20 minutes to share. I want to hear your recommendations. You should use your work you work protection equipment okay very good you should use you, you should use a protection equipment you should mm -hmm. use protection equipment in the workplace very good okay so minor uh, ¿quién está en tu grupo? Mm -hmm. ¿Quién? Cristian. Cristian. No hay Cristian. ¿Quién es Cristian? Cristian. 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 Ah, dice Cristian. Cristian. Ok. Ahí se fue. ¿Dónde está? Ok. No, no, no. All right, very good, minor. So, danos cinco de tu lista. Five. Go. Mm, ok. Uh, you should be booked out. You should be punctual, okay? You should express your uh, ideas in the office. You should express your ideas. Ideas. Ideas, yeah, ideas, yeah. Se escribe igual que, que el español, solo que se pronuncia ideas. La um, you should not discriminate uh, against your, your co-workers. Very good. You should not discriminate against your co-workers. Very good. Very good. You, you should not be macing in the office. You should not be macing? Messi, eh, como desordenado. desordenado. Ah, Messi. Messi, uh-huh. Like the football player. The office. Uh -huh. the office. <laughs> yes. Very good. Uh, and you should not talk during the meeting. Very good, minor. Excellent. 10, 10 points, 10 points. Very good. Let's see, who else? ¿Quién más? ¿Quién va? Yo. yo. Okay, Oli, go. Yeah. Five, only, only five. Okay, uh, my manager shall not to use his tone, the voice. My manager should not use to use uh -huh. to use his strong the voice. Strong voice, como una voz fuerte, una voz fuerte. Exacto. Yeah. Strong voice. Strong voice. Okay. All right. Number two. Javier, Javier should not to know the rules. Eh, no sé cómo se dice reglas. Rules. Rules. Okay. Yes. Um, uh, Sophie should not to say lovely, lovely, okay. lovely. Mm -hmm. should, should, should not shout. Yeah. Okay. Ahí, ahí estoy notando que estás poniendo después de should, le estás poniendo to. To get. To get. To shout. Yeah. No. Mm -hmm. No necesario to. No es parte de la estructura, sino que solamente un verbo. Por ejemplo, okay. eh, eh, Carlos should not shout at work. Okay, y, y después se había puesto Carlos, eh, eh, espérame, 
Carlos should be happening forever. Okay. Carlos should be happy. Yeah. Forever. forever. Okay. Very okay. good. Excellent. Good job. Francisco, who was in your group? ¿Quién estaba contigo? Who was with you in your group? Harold. Harold. Okay. Very good. So, five. Give me five of the ones that you did. Uh, you should be organizator. Very good. Mm -hmm. You should not be loud in the office. Good, good. You should print the report. Good. You should not come later to work. Very good, Isaac. Excellent. Good job. Okay, good. Uh, let's see who else. Uh, hey. David, who was with you? Ah, Danilo and no sé quién que estaba contigo, Danilo, but you can go. Danilo? Hello. Hello? Yes, uh, you should. Hello, teacher. Mm -hmm. No sé si está teniendo should... problema con tu conexión. Yes, I think. Okay. All right. You should wear mask in the company. Mm -hmm. You should and and try in the company without disinfect. Mm -hmm. You shouldn't eat in the office. Good. Mm -hmm. You shouldn't be loudy in the office. Mm -hmm. You shouldn't use your cell phone with the volume up. Okay. Okay, good, good, Danilo, excellent. Good job, Danilo and Pablo. Okay, let's do attendance first. Uh, attendance, Jaime Alexander, present? Yeah, teacher, I'm present. I'm I here. see you. Okay, tu, tuvo problemas antes, ¿verdad? Sí. Eh, a, ahora, porque no estaba ahorita a las nueve, pero se, se incorporó después de las nueve. Sí. All right, very good. Danilo. I'm here. Present, uh, Carla Stephanie. Present. Present teacher. Okay, uh, Luis Gustavo. Present teacher, I'm yeah. here. Very good. Alba Nubia. Present teacher. Uh, David Antonio. Present teacher. Harold Alexander. Present teacher. Francisco. Mm -hmm. Present teacher. Okay, good. Ana Romelia, eh, María Sonia. Present teacher. Good. Carla María. Present teacher. Okay. Eh, let's see. Crisia. Present teacher. See you. Omar Arturo. Yo me incorporé tarde. Eh, no okay. tenía problema para matarme hasta ahora. Okay, okay no, no problem. Aquí estamos. That's good. Thank you. Olimpia. Oli? Present. Present. Minor. Present teacher. Eh, Pablo. Present. And Manuel Alberto. Okay, very good. Excellent. Who else? ¿Quién no ha pasado? Eh, el grupo de Luis. Yes, María, okay. Yes. Who was in your group? No. Uh, no. No. ¿Quién estaba ahí contigo? David uh -huh. y Alex. Ok, good. Ok, five. Give me five rules. Should. Ok. Um, you should respect your worker. Uh -huh. Ajá. Uh, you should keep your workplace work tidy. Como ¿Tiri? espacio. The sí. uh, eh, espacio es slow. Ah, ok. O estás hablando libre con mucho espacio, como. No, no. como mantener tu espacio limpio, algo así. Ah, you should, you should maintain the space clean. 
Uh, sí, sí, sí. Uh -huh. Okay. Very good. Um, you should respect the boss. You should respect the boss. Good. Uh, you should not eat food while working. Very good. You should not eat food while working. You should get to the office earlier. Okay. You should get to the office earlier. Sí. Okay. Creo Very que good. Sí. Creo que todo pasaron, right? Todo falto. Alicia, yo falto. Uh, no, pero te, creo que tú estabas con minor. ¿Verdad, Cristian? Sí. Es que ya, yes. ya, ya las pasó minor, ya, ya las leyó. Ok, so te salvaste. All right, very good. So, let's go now to the next exercise. Ok, let's do this one together. All right, let's do this worksheet together. Should and shouldn't. Vamos a hacer esta worksheet juntos. Ok. She has flu. She what is the recommendation? Should. Should? Yeah. Should. Okay. She should stay home. Very good. Good job. Okay. Next. He has backache. He blank carry heavy things. Should not. So. Hmm? Should not. Should not. Shouldn't. Okay, shouldn't. Yeah. He shouldn't. shouldn't carry heavy things. Mm -hmm. Correct. He shouldn't carry heavy things. Okay. Very good. Next. She has a headache. She blank take painkillers. How do you say painkiller, teacher? Painkillers is like a like an aspirin, like a like a Tylenol, for example. Uh, oh, okay. Chewing. Should. 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 She has a headache. Okay, a ella le duele la cabeza. She. Chewing. She should. Take. Should it or should? Yeah. Should. 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 Take a should. 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 Yeah. Very good. Okay. Steve has a stomach ache. He drink lemon and mint tea. Should drink lemon and mint tea. Good, good. You have runny nose. You blank blow your nose. Do not blow should your not. Nose. You should not blow your nose. But running nose is that you have. Tenemos cosera. <laughs> yeah. So you should or shouldn't blow your nose. Should. 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 Para sacar eso, right? You should blow your nose. Uh, blow is como... Uh, blow, ¿qué significa? Blue. Soplar, en, no, en este contexto. No. Ah, ok. Entonces, I should. Ok. You should That's blow your nose. Mm -hmm. Ok. Daisy has dirty hands. She... Wash her hands. Should. 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 She should wash her hands. Should. 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 Recommendation, right? Yes. <laughs> My brother has two has toothache. He has tooth diente. Okay. Uh, toothache. She should he okay. eat not. candies. Sure. Should not. Should not. He should not eat should candies. Not eat candies. <laughs> Shouldn't eat candies. Correct? Okay. Okay. Number two. He feels okay. tired. I'm uh, sorry, no, no. Next. No, Jennifer. Sorry. Jennifer has a Jennifer. broken arm. She blank play volleyball. Should not. Should not, right? Should not. Yeah. Should not. She 
Contraction. Very good. He feels tired. He blank have a rest. Should. 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 Okay. Yes. Should. 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 Very good. Carolyn has a sore throat. What is a sore throat? For example, when your throat, it hurts. You have a cold. She should blank go, go to, to the doctor. A doctor. Should. She should, no. should. go to should. the doctor. Okay, very good. She has measles. Get us in measles. It's no. like a, a, es como, creo que se dice varicela, algo así. Like, varicela. Varicela, perdón. Varicela. 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 She should not go to school. She should not go to school. She should should or shouldn't. Should not go to school. Should not go to school. Uh, he has a cough. a cough. What is a cough? <coughs> cough. Oh, he blank drink cold med drinks. He should he or shouldn't should drink not. cold drinks. Shouldn't. He shouldn't drink. He shouldn't drink. Not. He shouldn't drink cold drinks. Okay. No. Okay. She has toothache. She should or should shouldn't go to the dentist. Recommendation, right? Yeah. Matt is fat. He should or shouldn't eat junk food. Should not. Should not. Should not. What is junk food? For example, McDonald's, pizza. Junk food. Yes. Right. Alice has cold. She blank have a rest. Should. 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 She should. Should. Have a rest. Have a rest. Good. 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 So, should take medicine. Should take so, medicine. Take medicine. Should. 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 medicine. Take medicine. Okay, very good. So let's check. Okay. But, eh, por veces tienen que tener cuidado. Por veces esta página eh, no detecta por veces el apostrophe. Que el apostrophe es el que usamos para hacer las contracciones. Eh, Estas hojas son creadas por teachers aquí, pero son gratis. Ustedes pueden. Let's check. Yeah? Everything good. Ten. We are wonderful. Yeah, excellent. Okay, very good, very good. Okay, questions for this exercise? Should and shouldn't. Okay. To give recommendations, to give suggestions uh, in the workplace. Okay, so the photo question is going to be uh, give me five rules in your workplace. Cinco reglas en su trabajo. Using should or shouldn't. Okay, okay, that's going to okay. be the photo, photo question. Okay, okay. Uh, let me see what else. Uh, ¿qué más? Pending, eh, estoy dando feedback en el foro. Ya voy por foro número 9. Estoy dando feedback en cada uno. Okay. 
personalizado, dando feedback, el, el, eh, todo muy bueno, el uso de, de todo lo que estamos aprendiendo aquí, muy bueno. Solamente que cuando escriben oraciones, usen punctuation. ¿Qué es punctuation? Puntuación. 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 Póngale un puntito. Sí, no puntuación. sí, porque están escribiendo cinco oraciones continuas, uh -huh. sin parar, sin ponerle un punto uh, cuando termine la oración, ¿verdad? Entonces, eh, eh, yo sé que así escribimos en el chat, ¿verdad? Pero acuérdense que estamos escribiendo en el foro. So, use punctuation, right? Para las preguntas, algunas no ponen el, el signo de, de, de interrogación. Entonces, no sé si es una pregunta o es una es a statement. So, I, I don't know. So, use punctuation, okay? But everything is good. Veo que cumplen las tareas, los objetivos, el uso de los verbos. Eh, todo lo que hemos visto, eh, muy bueno en el feedback, ok, del, del foro. So, very good. Ahí, ahí tenemos comunicación. Ustedes pueden ir, regresar. Quiero ver el foro para ver qué me puso el teacher. Lastimosamente, no, no le cae un mensaje. Quisiera que le cayera un mensaje para que usted pudiera ver, pero no, no, no tenemos esa opción. Eh, prueben en la app, en la application, ok. Tal vez en la aplicación sí les, 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 les da ese mensaje cuando yo les pongo un feedback, ¿ok? Eh, para trabajar del teléfono, mejor usen la aplicación. All right, very good. I'll see you tomorrow then, ¿ok? Ok. Okay. okay. See you tomorrow. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night.